Hey there fellows, Buddy Spike here. Me and Ducky wanted to have a casual cruise in some Russian death machines. So I dusted off my SU-33 and Ducky pulled out his fancy Mi-24 at the hind. And we went on a little formation flight, so enjoy the video fellas. So I'm gonna want you to firewall the throttle. I'm gonna firewall my plane or my not plane helicopter forward, and I want to see how fast it accelerates and see if you'll need to do mill or afterburner. All right. So all right. we drag brace basically. All right. All right. So we both go full power. Right. Yep. You guys have fun. I'll be off. All right. See you. All right. Then. See. You. All right. So three, two, one, full power. See you at the end of the runway. Oh, that's a good angle. Damn. Oh crap. Yeah, so you accelerate a lot faster on after burner. Yeah. Okay, just check at uh, what's your speed at the end of the runway. This is max power. 250. 260. 270. Um, 300. 300, okay. Keep, keep going straight, I'll form up on you. 310. And it stopped around 310. That's max speed. Alright. Oh, no, still going up. Spoke too soon. 320. So at, the, at the end of the runway, you were 300 easy. Alright. Okay. Just try to get in formation first, and then we'll yeah, worry about yeah. turns. Speed check? Uh, around 305. 305. Which plane has greater speed, the KA or Hind? The Hind. The Hind is the one of the fastest helicopter, helicopters in the world. I see. It actually h held the speed record for a while. Mm-hmm. Oh, this is sweet. Hello. Hello, hello. Easy, by the way, because you will get rotor wash. I think that's turned hard. off, right? Oh shit! I don't think I did. It's oh, fine. So far, so good. so far is good. Yeah, very it's just it's gonna be very difficult to stay like close under me. There you are. Hi. That looks really cool. Yeah, it does. Pulling it pretty nicely too. I didn't expect that for slow speeds. Now let's 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 make it. Or we have another island coming up. Let's just uh, give a little uh, slow and uh, slow and low pass. Um. Okay. You want to try a turn? This is gonna be really hard. So you're gonna make a U-turn? Not a U-turn. I'm gonna turn a little bit more to that island. I'm gonna all see right. what what island is that. Real quick. I'm not paying attention, so if I move at all, let me know. That's Rota off to our left. Rota. All right. We're gonna do a slight easy bank to line ourselves up with Rota. I'm gonna try to make it as easy as possible. All right. Okay. All right. All right. Coming left in three, two, one. Easing our left. And leveling her out now. Alright, never, never mind. Maybe that wasn't so bad. Yeah. Oh, oh, crap. Easy now. I'm getting a little bit of rota or rotor or not. <laughs> rota or of, rotor. Uh, I don't know. I'm getting a little bit of push over to my rudder, so I'm gonna push over a little off the line and we have to come right here. Hold on, I should have my yaw autopilot on, that would probably be helpful, wouldn't it? Mm-hmm. Alright, I'm gonna bring her right here in a moment. Alright, going right in three, two, one, easy, right now. Slowly. The slow, easy bank, not even that, like, it's barely gonna be any bank angle at all. Yeah. Just slowly easing her off to the right. 
I'm just gonna increase it slightly now. Slowly increasing a little bit. Cause this thing can turn this thing turns a lot more like a jet than a regular helicopter. Mm-hmm. Because it's so chonky. <laughs> it does have wings. Yeah, that's more for st stability and weapons, though. This thing is huge. Yeah. Like, this thing is quite literally akin to the size of your flanker. Mm hmm. Which, might I add, is like 30 meters by 30 meters. The new Apache looks really beautiful. I checked out some videos. Looks really sick. Oh, yeah. Oh, shit. Be easy with my shit. It's it's moving around a lot. Oh boy. Just be careful. Just any knots. What's our altitude? If you can get it to me. Uh, fifteen one five thousand. Wait, it's in meters, I think. So. It's like fifteen hundred meters. Yeah, fifteen hundred meters. Okay, yeah. So we'll start setting a little bit. That's like around three thousand feet. Yeah, it's very hard to look at my instruments like this. You also be careful that you, your wingtip vortices do affect my tail rotor. Really? Yep. Uh -huh. Quite significantly, actually. Uh -huh. So if you ever find me like slightly running off to the left, just ease off a little bit to the right. Because you don't need to be that close, because you you don't realize how big huge your wings are. You know, I'll tr I'll get directly behind you now. Let's see how that formation looks like. Well, I'm afraid you're gonna hit your tail if you straighten up a bit. That's a bit more dangerous. I the view from the right side is better. I need to tilt the set a little bit more for a low pass. Mm -hmm. Alright, we're gonna bring, I'm gonna slowly bring the nose more down even more. We're going pretty fast. 305. It, just as a warning, if I go below 330 to 350, I'm gonna violently roll to the right, so you might have to break off then, because that's over speeding. Oh, okay. Which I'm kind of pushing the aircraft probably a little bit more than it should be. Mm -hmm. So cruising at the landing speed for many jets is quite impressive for a helicopter. <laughs> Around uh, 150 knots, I think. Oh, Jesus. All right, we're getting really fast. That's 10 kilometers below uh, over speed, which will violently roll me to the right. Mm -hmm. And I probably won't be able to recover it at the altitude that we're going to. Still descending really fast. If I do go back a little bit more. Oh shit, I was in an F3 view and I messed up. Yeah, I saw that. So Easy. I'm gonna break off to the right and... Oh, alright. Let's give me a chance to land that. Or n unless you wanna still do it. Yeah, right. yeah. How about you line up for landing and then I'll rejoin? Yeah. <sighs> nice. The flares look beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> 